Hello everybody! Hi. How are you all? Today, as you can see, we are in a different place. Where are we, Jessica? My room! Yeah, we're in Jessica's room today for our recording because we have been demoted. Sharon is currently working from home, so we've had to find somewhere else to do our filming. So we thought we'd do it from Jessica's room. Now today, the Bible stories we are looking at are about people being called. There's a story about Samuel being called and a story about Nathaniel being called. So I thought today we would look at what it looks like to be called. Isn't that right, Jessica? Yeah. So here are some examples of being called. I hope you enjoy them. Dad! Hello? Where? Just follow my voice. Okay, I'm coming. It's very slippy. I know. Oh! Can you leave me a salad? You what, darling? Can you leave me a salad? Pardon? Can you read me a story? Of course I can read you a story. Oh, oh she's here. here. We've been trying to call you. You know, you know, we can't hear you. Sorry, but I'm really busy doing my work. Oh, yeah. We're really busy, aren't we, Jessica? Yeah, we're doing videoing. We're doing our work. Not as busy as me. I don't believe you. Well, do you want to see my to-do list? Uh, do you want to see ours? <laughs> it's like this long, isn't it, Jessica? Actually, it's like ten times the size. Yeah, there you go. I believe you. Where are the workers than you? <laughs> One of the things on the list is we need to go sledging. Yeah. Okay, I'll write it on, okay? All okay. right, hurry up. Bye! Bye! Bye. I wonder if you have ever been called in any of those ways or how do people call you in your life? Now the great news is, is I'm back in my workspace to finish off this video and I want to look at two very different calls, different to the ones we've just looked at. The first one is about a boy called Samuel who was called by God to do a very special job for him. And the second one is about a man called Nathaniel, who was called by the Son of God, Jesus, who said to him, come and follow me. Now, how did both of them respond? They both accepted the calls and did what God and Jesus were wanting them to do and found a great benefit from doing it. Now, I believe that everybody at some point in their life gets a call from God. Whether that's a call from God to receive him into their lives, to start following Jesus, or whether it is to do a special job for God. Now, sometimes people get more than one call. I wonder today, are you getting that call right now? Or have you got that call before in your life? It's all in how we respond to the call. Do we do what God is asking us to do? Do we let him into our lives? Do we start following Jesus? And do we do the job that he is asking us to do? Or do we ignore it and forget that it ever happened? I wonder if God is calling you today. Today, I want you to have a think about that. And maybe think about listening to God and looking out for his call in your life. Take care, everybody. God bless. And I'll see you again soon. This is my walkie-talkie. Are you sure it's not a microphone? Microphone thingy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can you cut this bit off, please? <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe not. Oh, you just stood your 
tune out earlier. And again. 